Hey guys, this is Andrew, and I'm here to show you how to play the acoustic guitar part of the song Mighty Sound. So to start off, you have to put your guitar to an alternate tuning. Um, to do that, you'll lower uh, the sixth string from an E down to a C. You'll lower the fifth string from an A down to a G. The fourth and third strings will stay the same, D and G. Uh, and then you'll lower the second string from a B to an A and the first string from an E to a D. All right, so what you have is C, G, D, G, A, D. And uh, this tuning works really well for songs in the key of G um, because you can get some really nice, rich sounding chords. The song, when it was recorded, is actually in the key of A flat. So if you want to play it in that key, just throw a capo on the first fret and then play all these chords relative to the posi uh, position of the capo. First chord is going to be a C. And you play that with an open sixth string, open fifth string, and then you'll fret the second uh, fret right here on the fourth string. All right. And you'll be playing um, the, these verse chords, at least the first half, uh, just steady downstrokes in eighth notes, and you'll be muting them with your uh, palm right here, okay? So it'd be like. Next chord will be a G, and you're gonna um, have your thumb over here on the sixth fret, so that way the note is dead. And then you have an open fifth string, and then you're going to be fretting um, the fifth fret right here on the fourth string. So you have these two notes. Next chord would be a D. You're going to actually bar right here on the second fret. You're going to have this D and A. And then your pinky, you're going to put on the fourth fret of the fourth string. So you have a D, an A, and an F sharp. And you have a, an E minor, which is, um, you're gonna also bar right here, but this time on the fourth fret, you have an E and a B, and then you'll use your middle finger right here on the, um, the fifth fret of the fourth string. So you have an E, a B, and a G, okay? Just an E minor chord. So that first half of the verse, you'll just be using those four chords in uh, different sequences. Um, The next part of the verse, you'll be playing another version of a C chord, which is this. You have the open sixth string. The fifth string is uh, Frederick here on the fifth fret. The fourth string is dead. You'll be using your middle finger. Um, you're going to angle it in such a way that that string will be dead. Um, then you have open third string, and then the B, uh, I'm sorry, the second and first strings our fret right here, or you're gonna be pressing down on the fifth fret right here. So that's your C chord. The next chord after that is an E minor, and you just play that like this, okay? And in this case, the fifth string will be dead, using your index finger um, to do that. So you move from the C chord to an E minor chord. From there, you go to a D chord, just played like this. You have um, the sixth string will be fretted down on the second fret, and then you have a dead fifth string, and then the fourth, third, and second strings will be open, and then you'll fret down right here at the fourth fret, press down right here on the fourth fret um, at the first string, okay? So that's a variation of a D chord. Um, then there will also be a G right here. Using your thumb right here to deaden this string. And then you have open fifth, open fourth, open third strings. And then um, the second and first strings right here will be pressed down on the uh, fifth fret. Okay. So for that section of the verse, what you want to do is two downstrokes, eighth notes, okay? And 
then you're gonna put your left hand, you're gonna put them over the strings, and then just do down up, down up. Okay, so it's like, I'm sorry. Got it? So you're gonna do that in between each chord for that part of the verse. All right? Um, so you'll do that a couple times, that sequence, and then what you'll do is you'll play um, this E minor chord that I showed you, then go to the D, and then this next chord here, which is my personal favorite, um, it's kind of an A7 over a C sharp, I guess that's the best way to call it. Um, so you're going to fret down, first fret on the sixth string, this string will be dead, again. And then you're gonna have, um, you're gonna press down on the second fret of the fourth string. The third string will be open. And then you'll have um, the second fret pressed down right here on both the second and first strings. Okay, so you have. So it's like. Then you'll go back to this C chord. And then you'll play. G over a B. I'm using my um, middle finger this time to deaden this string, the sixth string, and then my index finger is on the fourth fret of the fifth string. And then you can play the open fourth string if you want, but um, the way I do it is I just um, right now that string is dead too. So and then you have an open third string, and then these two notes. So that's your G over B. So yep, C. Moving into the G over B, and then, okay? So that's a huge chunk of the song. Um, you're just gonna be using most of those chords, and some of them are gonna switch around, but if you listen to the track, you can hear you know where the chords will be placed. There is one other chord that I haven't showed you yet, though, and that comes in the part where um, Tim hits that really high note, right where the electric guitar riff comes in. Um, the sequence of chords in that part goes, uh, you have your C, and then that D chord, and then that G over B, and then this chord, which I haven't shown you yet, which is kind of an A suspended. Um, you're gonna be deadening this string, and then fretting down using these two fingers, on the second fret of the fifth and fourth strings, okay? Um, and then the top three strings will be open. So it's like. All right. So that's pretty much the whole song, at least for the acoustic guitar. Um, if you have any questions, just let me know. And uh, as always, please feel free to subscribe to us on YouTube and like us on Facebook. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.